The Catch Mastery Ice event is now live in Pokemon Go, which means Shiny Cryogonal is in the game, and luckily for us, we're gonna have some easy checks for it. We have this free timed research right here, which we have to catch two snow runs, catch two Bergmite, and then make three nice throws. But not only that, we also got the paid ticket, so as you can see down here, it's the exact same thing. So we're gonna get eight checks per just doing all of this. So that should be pretty easy, and I'm excited to get that Shiny Cryogonal. It looks pretty good, and the best part about it is we only need really one because it doesn't evolve or anything like that. But before we dive into this research, I actually have some field research right here, which gives me Cryogonal. And this research specifically was to take three snapshots of different wild ice type Pokemon. And this is the kind of quest we're gonna have after this event, so if you don't get the shiny Cryogonal, you'll still be able to get it through these kind of researches. But with that being said, let's see our first check. Will we get the shiny? Of course, we also have our research breakthrough box after this, but we don't get a shiny on the first one. 11.56, we want an 11.99. That is the hundo, and I don't believe I have a hundo of this. So that'll be another big goal. Now, before we can move on, let's claim the box and see what we get inside of it. 2,000 dust. 20 Pokeballs, and of course we get the XP. And our encounter is with a Galarian Weezing. That's actually pretty cool. Unfortunately, not a shiny one, but nonetheless, an interesting encounter. Now, were you a good Weezing? You were decent, actually. 13, 14, 13. Now, back to the Cryogonals. Let's get those orange eyes. It's such a beautiful shiny. I really like the look of it, and this one's a lot better. How about you, my friend? What are you gonna be? Not a shiny for these three, but it was worth a shot. Anytime there's a boosted shiny event like this, or a Go Fest, or anything like a Community Day, if you can get the research for that Pokemon specifically, and bring it in beforehand, it'll still be able to be shiny. The Pokemon in the research isn't determined until you claim that research. Unlike an egg, when you pick up an egg, it already knows what it's gonna be, but when it's a research, it just creates the Pokemon the moment you hit the research encounter, so that's why it's good to bring them in. And now it's time to dive into our first pages of the timed research. Both of them are completed, because yet again, they're both exactly the same, so that's fantastic. Let's see if we get the orange eyes. It's such a beautiful shiny, and I'm really hoping we get it from this. Though I have seen a few people not get the shiny from this, which is a little concerning, but nothing's guaranteed. So here's number two of this first one. Not an orange-eyed one, sadly. 1162. And the third one from this page is gonna be not a shiny and 1162 again. Okay, a little weird. Now let's move on to the next one and then we'll do the final rewards afterwards. This one right here is gonna be not a shiny and a 1170. Number dose. What are you? No. And 1162 again. Oh boy, I feel like that's gonna be a number we see a lot. Number three of the paid one is not shiny and 11... 82? Okay, I think that's the biggest one we've seen so far. Now it's time to claim the final rewards for both of them. This one right here is going to give us 10 Pokeballs. We're also going to give it some XP. And no orange eyes on this one. 11, 70, or 67, not 76. I literally woke up just like a little bit ago. And then we've got this one. More Pokeballs, more XP, and not the shiny. 1151 as well. This one's not great. Now for page 2 of 10, we have to make 5 nice throws, catch 5 ice-type Pokemon, and use 3 berries to help catch Pokemon. And that's the exact same thing here. Well, this hardly took any time at all. We finally Finally finished these ones. So this one is not orange eyed. 1183. Dose, are you going to be it? You're not it. And 1163. Number three, what do you got for me? Not a shiny, that's for sure. Let's move on to the second one here. We get ourselves not an orange eyed one. 1179. Two in the middle is going to be not it. And an 1154. And then the last one on this one isn't it. An 1170. And now on to the final rewards for both of these. We're going to be getting ourselves some Nanab berries. We're going to get some XP. And and no orange eyes, 1161. And the final rewards for this one are the exact same stuff. Obviously, that's gonna keep happening, and not a shiny, 1156. Now we have to make five nice curveball throws, catch five ice type Pokemon, and use three Nam Nam berries while catching Pokemon. Very simple, very easy. But before we work on that, I do have three more Cryogonal quests here. They were to make great curveball throws, and specifically, the other one was just seven great throws. So they're not that hard to do, which is great. And we get extra checks, which is also fantastic. How about you, my friend? Will you be the one? It'd be cool if you were, but you're not. And 76. And last but certainly not least, we have not a shiny from this one, 1185. That's the biggest one so far. On the upside, this takes no time at all to complete, so this is pretty easy stuff, but hopefully we'll see a shiny in this. Like I said a little earlier, I've seen a few live streams where people didn't get the shiny from the 80, basically, encounters, which, you know, it is what it is. It is all RNG, but I do hope that we don't get skunked on it, because it would be nice to get it from this. So how about you? Will you be the one for me? You're not going to be the one for me. And a 90. There we go. That's nine off. And the last one of the first one's going to be not it and a 61. Alrighty then. Let's move on to these ones down here. What are you gonna be? Not the one. 59. Let's do you. You're gonna be not the one either. 65. And then the last one's gonna be oh man. 85. Final rewards time. We're gonna be getting some razzes this time. That's kind of fun. And of course orange eyes. Nope. <laughs> 
come on, page three, part two. Will you? No, nope, you won't. 80. Now we gotta make three nice curveball throws in a row, catch five ice type Pokemon, and then use three raspberries to help catch Pokemon. Easy enough, and yet again, we have three more encounters from just normal old event research, so no for you. 50. How about you, my friend? Nope. And 64. And then the last one. Not it as well. 69. Nice. We've got a singular check here from the normal research. It's gonna be... Oh, yeah! Yes! Let's go! Let's freaking go! We got the shiny. Ladies and gentlemen, if you haven't already smashed that subscribe button yet, please do. Definitely not stopping here. We're gonna keep going and try to get as many of these as possible and hopefully a good one, but that is such a solid shiny, right? With the eyes and everything like that, it looks really good. And it's so funny that we got it from just a singular by itself research. I was even thinking about claiming this like off camera, and I'm so glad I didn't, but man, look at that. That looks really good. Let's just take a look at his IVs. 11, 12, 13. It's all right, all things considered. It's a decent shiny. This thing isn't very useful for anything at all, so it doesn't really matter when it comes down to the IVs. Well, now that we've done that, let's complete these and see if we get another one. That'd be so cool, but not two in a row on this one. We can technically still get skunked on the time research, but in the end of the day, at least we got this shiny. You in the middle, not a shiny one, and an 11.56. And then the last one here will be another not shiny, an 11.68. How about you? The next one, nope. One in the middle on the bottom one is not it. And then the bottom one is going to be not a shiny as well. 1181. And let's see what we get for the final rewards. Pineapple berries, we get XP, and not it, but an 1160. And then the same exact rewards yet again of pineapple berries and XP, and not a shiny here, 1183. And now we have to make five nice curveball throws in a row, catch five ice type Pokemon, and use three pineapple berries while catching Pokemon. Very simple. I'm gonna do these ones first, seeing that last time it worked out pretty good for us. So number one is going to not be shiny, and an 1170. Followed up by a also not shiny 1164 and then number three is not a shiny 1188 no worries at all let's continue with the timed research this one is an 1177 this one in the middle will be also not a shiny 1173 and of course it dodges me and then the bottom one will you be the one you will not be the one 1177 yet again moving on to the second one we get ourselves a not it i'm feeling like these are perma boosted like one in 64 odd rate so far from what I've been seeing from other people and from my own experience, because I don't believe I've even hit the 60s yet, and we do have one, so that's pretty good. But yet again, I'd like to get at least one from the timed research, so hopefully that happens. And now for the final rewards, we're gonna be getting ourselves Pokeballs, we're gonna get even more XP, and a Snowflake, 1169 again. And wouldn't you know it, 10 more Pokeballs, 1,000 more XP, and another Snowflake. Oh, 1190. And now we have to make three great curveball throws, catch five Snow Rot, and catch five Bergmite, and yet again, that's all we have to do down here as well. During this event, Snowrunt and Bergmite are both shiny boosted, and luckily for me, we actually did find one right here. The yellow snow looks absolutely beautiful. And I got really lucky with this thing last year when it was released. I think I got about like four or five of them. Like, we got very, very lucky. But it's still cool to get shinies. It's cool to have extra boost on things that are useful, because this Pokemon's actually pretty decent in Master League from what I've heard. Also, the Hisuian variant is good. And Snowrunt is also really good for Great League, but this one's actually not bad. 5, 14, 10. And there's two Snowruns here I haven't checked, so let's see if we get a blue snow runt. That'd be pretty cool, but no. Let's get back to the snowflake checks. This one is an 1163, followed up by a, oh, not it, 1160. And then last but certainly not least, not it, and a 1174. Three more of the event researches gives us not a shiny from this one, 1182. Now that we've got that shiny, I really want that hundo, or a shundo. You know, I want to complain about that, but this is definitely not close to either of those things. How about you, my friend? Will you be the one? You are not shiny and an 1169 yet again. Nice. Now let's see what these give us. Hopefully these will have something in it. It is a 74. Number dose will be also not the one. 63. And three is also not it. 88. 11 off the hundo. And like usual, we're gonna just continue off of these and do the final researches last and do the final encounter stuff at the end. But this is also not it. 11.46. Number three. No. Final rewards time. What do we get for page six of ten? We get great balls. We get even more XP, surprisingly. And no shiny from here. 11.94. Wow, that is five off. I feel like this is going to be like Hisuian Sneasel, where I keep getting 98s and not getting that hundo, but hopefully it will break through that barrier. And then more Great Bulls, more XP, and no shiny. We got an 1162. And for page 7 to 10, we have to make three Great Curveball throws, catch 10 Snow Runs, and catch 10 Berg Bites. Easy enough. Three more encounters from the researchers here. We got ourselves a 68. The top one this time will give us not a shiny and a 62. And how about this guy right here? What are we feeling from you? Not it, and an 82. Three more 
more of these and then we're back to the timed research. You are not it. 68, my friend, please. Our next one's going to be also no orange eyes with 1153. And then this one right here is not it, sadly. 87 though. 87's pretty darn good. And now on to the timed research for page 7 of 10. This one will be a 57. Come on, Hundo Energy. That'd be great right now. You're not a shiny and you're not a Hundo. And the bottom one. No. Oh, it's huge. That's kind of fun. And an old oh, man, imagine if it was a huge hundo. And then the second timed research gives us a 93. Man, we're getting decent enough IVs right now. That's nice. Did the bottom one on accident. Let's see what we get from this one. <laughs> Not a shiny. And then the middle one will be new shiny 1183. Final rewards for this one are going to be ultra balls. We're going to get more XP, surprisingly. And we get ourselves a 62. And wouldn't you believe it? More ultra balls and XP followed by a snowflake that isn't shiny. 1166. And now for 8 to 10, we have to make 5 great curveball throws, catch 10 snow runs, and catch 10 bird bites yet again. Page 8 of 10 is done. When we get ourselves an 1171 as our first encounter, not the best. How about you? Are you gonna be the one? Nope, not fit for this one. 1160. And the third one's gonna be not it in a 48. I think I saw that 43 is the floor. A friend of mine got that recently. But let's keep going with the second one. This one is not it. 1180. Sure would be swell to see another shiny soon, but that's that's not happening. I'm afraid the thing I feared most might happen. I might not get a shiny from this at all. It's looking like that's gonna happen. But maybe these final research rewards will give it to us. We get some dust, we get some XP, and not a shiny. Maybe this dust and XP and an encounter will be the shiny. It's not though, 65. Now for page nine of 10, we have to make three great curveball throws in a row, catch 10 ice type Pokemon and make an excellent throw. And we could easily do that in just a little bit. But first, how about these encounters? Will we get something from this? This is a 75. How about this one? Will this one be good? It's not it's shiny, but it's also huge. That's cool. And a 73. And last but certainly not least, we got ourselves a 78. We're gonna go back to the traditional route on this one. Go on the top with these event ones, not shiny. I'm also clicking a lot of snow runs and stuff along the way, of course, trying to get as many shinies as possible. And the third one, not shiny. Good lord, man. What's going on with my rates? Maybe the timed one will finally give us a shiny. Not with this one, though. 75. Number dose will be not a shiny. And our third one, no orange. 11.55. And then number two is a no. The middle one on the second one is going to also not be shiny. And the third one, oh yeah, yeah, not happening. 1151. Final rewards this time are going to be a thousand Stardust. We're also going to get ourselves 2,500 XP. And oh, there we go. We got a shiny from the special research or the timed research, but technically it's a special timed research. Anyways, doesn't matter. We actually freaking got one. Oh man, I'm happy about that. I was a little worried it wasn't going to work out. You know what I mean? But so glad that it did. And and the 70s isn't bad. Obviously, 90s is where the hundo lies, but 1176 is going to be any second now if you choose to load. Come on, there we go. 15, 12, 10. That's fine. Can we back to back it though? That would be pretty cool. So let's get more dust, more XP, and not a shiny. 1190. And for 10 of 10, we have to make five great curveball throws in a row, make an excellent throw, and make an excellent curveball throw. Let's do it. Three more snowflake tasks. This one is not it, and 68. Come on, 99. That's really what we're looking for here. 76. And the third one is not a shiny and a 76 again. We'll start with the middle on this one. Are we going to get orange eyes? No, we're not. And a 61. Now I'm curious if these are going to become full odds after this event. I kind of doubt it, but it could happen. This one is a 64. And this one right here will be a 93. Starting from the bottom with these three, it's a 90. Sure would be swell to get a 99. This one will be a 73. And... Uh, the top one is a huge one again. We're getting a lot of huge snowflakes, which is cool. 61. Let's just start from the top with these three. Not orange eyes and a 62. Come on, hundo. I would really appreciate it. This one is a 76. And then the last one here is also not shiny and a 56. Oh my goodness. I do love how common the quest is. I mean, this is basically just a large research day, but not one in 10 shiny rates, but that seems to be fine for a whole 10 hours of grinding. Honestly, I like days like this. I think they're fantastic, but I'd like to get the hundo. Three more and then we're gonna finish page 10 to 10. So let's see what we get from these things. 96, yep, just like Sneasel. We're literally going to be getting stuff right next to the hundo, but not quite the hundo. How about you, my friend? What are you gonna be? It's a 76. And then the third one will give us a 50. Now let's do page 10 to 10 and just finish all this stuff up. This one is going to be a 75. Number two will be a 81. The third one will be a 94. Of course it 
will. Will we see a 99 today? Let me know in the comments down below if you think we're gonna reach it. Number four, what are you gonna be, my friend? A 96 again, my goodness, stop it. Five, are you gonna be the 99? That's a 74. And number six is gonna be a 76. Final reward time, and this time is gonna be it. So we get 1,500 dust, we get ourselves 3,000 XP, and a 71. This is the very final one we get of the timed research, though this is the paid one. Let's see what happens. It's not shiny, and it's a 73. Well, at least we did get one shiny out of all of that, which is great. I did see some people got skunked on that, so I'm happy that I got it. Also, let me know in the comments down below if you got yourself a shiny from either the free or the paid one. And also, let me know how good it was. Hopefully, it was a decent one, but let's take a look at this guy. He is fine. But now that we're done with that, we're just gonna keep exploring. We have so many more stops to spin, and we got a lot of cryogonal quests to go for. Now, honestly, I think we're getting that hundo, so let's head out. Hopefully, the beeping in the background isn't too loud, but let's start off with these ones. It is a 90, yet again. I like that we're seeing a lot of them in the 90s. That's pretty nice. 60, though. And the third one. Come on, buddy. It is 67. Hono dos. I shiny. 1154. All right, that's our third one. Ah, oh, this feels great. Even though I don't know why it just golden raspberry this thing. It's not like it get, get away from us, but whatever. Unless it dukes us to the side. Get in your home, buddy. There we go. 1154 is gonna be a 10, 11, 13. Do we get back to back, though? That would be super cool, but we don't, and a 51. This one on the top is going to be a 67. How about this one in the middle? It is a 77. Does that mean that this one's gonna be an 87? I can see it. It is a 54. Starting from the bottom, we don't have a shiny 57. Followed by the next one in the middle will be a not a shiny and a 90 again. We're getting a lot of them in the 90s, and this one's gonna be a 91. Middle this time, we're gonna get a not shiny. That's a 75. We'll go with the bottom one next. This one is going to be a 73. And the last one here is going to be a not shiny and an 8. From the top, we've got a shiny one. Let's go. 64. All right, the shiny luck is picking up a lot more now, which is fantastic. Hopefully we'll get a shiny in the 90s or 99. Man, I'd, I'd go for a shunda one of these. These things actually look pretty cool. Let's see what those IVs are on a 64. It is a 10, 15, 13. Can we double it up back to back? We do not, and it is a 51. And of course, the last one is going to be a 70. Middle one, will you be shiny? No, and a 85. Top one's gonna give us a 80. And then the bottom one will be giving us a 68. Come on, Hundo Energy, I kinda need it. Or I don't need it, I want it. It was also a 93, that was pretty good. How about you, what are you gonna be? A 62. And then we've got ourselves this one that is an 84. This one's gonna be not shiny and a 80. This one's gonna be a not shiny and a 67. Well, this last one here, what are you gonna be for me? Not a shiny for sure and an 82. Middle's gonna be not shiny and a 73. How about the top one? It's gonna be a 59. And then this last one's going to be a 81. And the incense provides us with another shiny bergmite. Though I don't know why those snow runs don't like us. At least the bergmites do. And honestly, out of the two of them, I'd much rather have this one because this one is a relatively newer shiny. We've had snow run out for nearly five years now, I want to say. So it's fine that we're not getting a lot of those. Bergmite, I feel like, is a little bit more rare. And this one is 10, 15, 0. Cool. At least we got this shiny. I will say that the uh, Carogonals are not treating us very well now. And now after like four hours of walking, Tommy finally decided to finally come out. Uh, Somebody yeah. may have gotten it while laying in bed from the special research. Yep. <laughs> They're terrible. Got to take my time. Terrible person. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame them though. That's actually pretty good. But yeah, I think we're just going to grind a little bit. I kind of want to walk more. You, you want you want to go to like Rollins or something like yeah, that? Why I mean, not? You know, there's a lot why of stops not? there. Yeah. Well, we, before we do that though, I do have some right here. So maybe we'll get another shiny snowflake. We've had a little bit of a dry streak on these. Now I've gotten four, so it's weird to say it like that, but recently, like the ones that we've recently done have been pretty dry. And I just got done talking to a buddy of mine, his name's V, he just went into the store I left and he actually got the hundo as well. So we still need to get that hopefully, but that's not happening here. Do you have a hundo? Did you get I, that laying in bed too? No, I did not unfortunately. So I guess I'm after that too. Well, on the way to our next destination, we did finally get a shiny snow runt, which is nice, you know. This actually was a white whale for me for the longest time until I wanna say second Chicago go fest. I wanna say that's when I finally got the thing. But is it good? But is it good? Ladies and gentlemen, let's find out. Yeah, it's fine, I guess. It is a really nice day today. Like, it's been kind of chilly for the last couple days, but right now it's just fantastic. Hopefully we can get some more shinies, though, because I've done a few 
of these now. They don't seem to want to shine anymore. It'd be cool though if you did. Come on, buddy. 79, 20 off the Honda. And the last one is gonna be not it. Good lord, 1146. And we finally got another shiny Kragnal. Like honestly, this took a little while to get. We've done, I want to say, close to 80 encounters before we got to this one, so I'm glad cry? we got it. Are you gonna cry? I am going to cry, Agonal, yes. Ah, but it feels good. I haven't gotten a hundo yet, but of course we've gotten a few, like, 1190s. See how good this one is? It is a 10, 13, 11. But will we get a back-to-back? -back? That'd be cool. We don't. Okay. And 1178. Well, quite a few hours have passed. I'm with Goku now. How's it going, Goku? Hi, guys. He downgraded. He also... <laughs> <laughs> yes, you're right. You're absolutely right. He did get himself uh, a shiny recently. That was the one big reason he wanted to come out. But uh, I just finally got another one after a few hours. This one's the best one I've ever gotten, though. 1190. That is nine off the hundo. I'm going to go on a limb here and say it's probably either a 93 or a 96, depending on what. And it could be a Goku bad, seeing that we are with the Goku bad himself. So you know what? We're going to keep him in the frame. And no. Yeah, it's a 93. Actually, no, I think that's a 91. Yeah, that's a 91. Okay. No, that's a 93. That's 15, 14, 13. Yeah? I thought that was like a 91. I thought it would be... No, the, yeah, you're right. That is a 93. I was thinking to myself wrongly, if it was like a 15, 15, 13, that would have been a 96. But anyways, best one I've gotten so far, so not complaining at all. If only I could favor it. There we go. Just for fun, can we go back to back? Probably not, but yeah, definitely not, and not the hundo. Still trying to get that thing, and I am well coming up to 400 encounters now with this thing. So I think I just got the floor for a shiny, which is cool. Not quite the Shundo, obviously, and I still don't know why I decided to Golden Raspberry it. It's not like I can get away, but we're still trying to get that Hundo, and we only have less than 15 minutes left, but admittedly a 10-10-10 would be pretty funny, so let's see what happens here. It's the floor. All right. I mean, honestly, that is pretty rare. It's the same as getting the Shundo, just obviously not as cool, but I'm down with that. This might be the last shiny we get as well, which is funny. And now we're officially done with the full 10 hours of the Cryogonal Research Day. It was a long day and we put in a lot of work. As you can see right here, I have 394 of them in my inventory. And that doesn't include the 100 in my stack and there's definitely a 100 in there. And I probably did even more than that and we probably cycled through them. So I would say we did about 500 checks today, which is pretty good. When it comes down to shinies, we managed to get eight shiny Krygonals, which is pretty cool. I'm down with that, especially because we got literally the worst one possible, which is basically the reverse Shundo. So this will be the one I probably keep for my Myself because this is the rarest one out of all of them. And as for shinies today, we got 13 of them, even though technically only 12 are from the event. I got the Lillipop afterwards. Yeah, not bad. We got two snow runs and two Bergmites as well, and they were boosted shinies during the time, so it's neat. But all in all, I had a great time. Sadly, did not get a hundo out of all those 500 plus researches, but that's just RNG. Even though I did get 598s, every single one of them being 1196s. And let me tell you, it stung a lot. Smash that subscribe button if you enjoyed today's video video and let me know in the comments down below. How did you like this research day? Did you get the shiny? Did you not get the shiny? How about the hundo? How about a shundo? Let me know in the comments down below. And if you're really enjoying the content and you want to see more of it, I highly suggest this video over here. But with that being said, I'll see you in the next one.